Traffic in Fenwick Island drawing an extra set of eyes. Good evening. I'm Madeline Overturf. Welcome to our News at 5. We begin tonight with Fenwick Island's Business Committee discussing possible parking changes. Some stores in town are busy at night, leaving little to no free parking spaces outside certain businesses. And so some employees and paying customers only have one option for parking, metered spaces. Coast TV News reporter Kevin Zappay explains how this can be an issue and what ideas the committee has to solve it. Driving into Fenwick Island and putting your car in park to enjoy some waves or to go shopping and grab a bite. But if all the designated parking spots are full, you'll have to park in the metered parking. Greg DeRoche admits parking can be limited, especially in the summer. The parking on the east side of Bunning Avenue, during the season, there's usually lots of cars um, in this area. With some businesses having an influx of people come during the night, it's not uncommon to see lots full, which is why Fenwick Island's business committee is discussing possible changes to ensure all parking spaces are utilized. Kurt Zanilotti, who is the head of the Fenwick Island Business Committee, explains what changes might be coming. The parking permit is required or metered parking is required from 8.30 until 10 o'clock at night. Um, one of the Business Concerns Committee members asked if we could change the parking from that to 8.30 to 5 p.m. so there would be free parking after 5 p.m. However, not everyone is on board with this idea. Fenwick Island Mayor Natalie Magdeberger explains how metered parking during those times bring in revenue, which helps cover the cost of their parking inspector, who makes sure everyone in Fenwick is parked correctly. Although the mayor doesn't agree with these changes, she's open to possibly having one or two days of free parking between 5 and 10 p.m. While the committee and council members are still discussing what changes people may be seeing next summer, DeRoche has faith in whatever they decide. I got a lot of confidence in this town council and in our leadership. The Fenwick Island Business Committee has yet to make any changes to parking in Fenwick Island, but said they will be discussing it further during their next meeting. I'm Kevin Zappay in Fenwick Island, Coast TV News.